All right, fish folks, how's it going? So last night I spent uh, a couple hours, pretty much, like I said in my previous video, uh, switching up everything. So it's not quite done uh, 100%. Uh, I still have some stuff left to do. As you can see, there's, it's, the landscape is in. Uh, but basically, I took out all the fish in this 125. Except for my little Frontosa. Uh, I kept him in here uh, just because Frontosa, it's a cool fact of the day, uh, actually grow twice as slow as uh, pretty much any other cichlid. So uh, I want to keep him in the 125. And he's not, he doesn't bother anyone and no one picks on him. So that's good. Uh, and then I went out and I got 10 more. Lawandas. So now total, I have 16 in here. And uh, from what I could tell, I have five males and 11 females. And I will be selling two of the males right away and then hopefully keeping the other two, including this big guy. So that'll make three males and 11 females, if my math is correct. And so I did that because I wanted to do a whole colony tank. And so unfortunately this tank isn't quite as colorful anymore. And for some reason, I, ever since I moved this guy, he's a little bit more skittish. And you can't really see his colors 100% yet, uh, at least on this video. But in person, uh, he looks better in this tank than he ever has. Which is pretty impressive because he's looked pretty great. Uh, so hopefully I'll have a bunch of fry soon. Uh, and then once they hit the one inch-ish mark, if I get anywhere from 50 to 100 fry, and like I said, once they hit the one inch mark, I'll probably put them all in here, grow them out, sell them, or whatnot, and then hopefully by that time, my Cherry Nagara flame tails will walk over there. Will be big enough to put in the 125. And this is what I want to have a colony of. I got, I think, one male and seven females. And I want to put the whole colony in there and breed this in the 125. I'll breed other stuff in 40 breeders or whatnot, but I want these guys in the 125. Now, I apologize for the, the dirty tanks. I still haven't uh, wiped off any of the uh, watermarks or anything yet. You may have seen uh, when we came over here, I have this guy in here. And that, that's not the water level, the water level's up here. So don't worry, that's the water level inside the tank. This is a green face peacock, or Alanacara solosi. S-A-U-L-O-S-I, I believe. And uh, it's, it's the green face. He doesn't necessarily have a green face. It's uh, like a purplish blue. And he was he's he was more colorful yesterday, but he's he's going out and getting shipped uh, tomorrow. So uh, I just put him in here for a day, and uh, he gets orange and then real beautiful blue and purple. They're they're really nice, and uh, I have a local person here who, who breeds them. Down here are the show fish. So you got LeBron, you got the Intermedius, you got the Blue Fire. Uh, there is another green face. That's my green face. Uh, there's a uh, Sunshine and Sulfur Heads hiding. But that's that. And then up here, we have Steph Curry, the yellow OB along with a bunch of females, and we are going to make some yellow OB babies. Uh, I don't see too many. You can see one's holding right there. 
I don't see too many yellow OBs around hardly ever. And I just, I love the fact that he's like part Nagara, just real bright yellow. So that's what we're doing here. And then we head over here. You can see the Taiwans and the Dragon Bloods got put in here. Eventually, once I uh, sell all of the Lemon Jakes, this tank for now will be Taiwan and Dragon Blood because they don't uh, they don't interbreed with each other or anything like that. Uh, I just love that Dragon Blood's color; it's super red. And then over here, can't see it well because it's in a in the net. But this is a true uh, Hap Ali White Knight, so the, the the White Knight kind. You can see it doesn't help have the albino eyes, not red eyes. So it's not the albino electric blue Ali. It's the actual White Knight. And uh, this guy's actually going to uh, one of my buddies, uh, and he's also getting shipped out here soon. And uh, I will uh, post an update within a couple weeks on him. And that is all the updates I have for you as of right now. Uh, please do not forget to uh, check this YouTube as I will be posting a couple reviews also this week and I will be posting that um, Friday giveaway pun intended so thanks for watching guys